Where's your Christmas spirit? Don't get me started. It's fitting that Christmas is in the title of this show the actors are rehearsing for the Flat Rock Playhouse. He did! I did, I did! That's because this theater is a real gift. It's a real blessing to be a part of this. Scott Treadway is an actor in his 34th season here. I feel very lucky because I got, I've gotten to be a part of the process of watching this playhouse grow. This place got its start in 1937. Actor and director Rob Roy Farquaad performed in places like Miami and New York with a group of performers known as the Vagabond Players. And it really just encapsulates the life of an actor, which is essentially having no permanent home. After hearing great things about the weather and the beauty in Hendersonville, they came here, set up a big circus tent, and did 10 plays in 11 weeks. That set the stage for what became the Flat Rock Playhouse. I think people feel really proud to have such an exceptionally high-end arts uh, institution tucked away in, in these mountains. And while the players on the stage and behind the curtain now aren't necessarily the roaming vagabonds who came before them, they certainly had to seek out a place like this to make them feel at home. Even those of us who are now permanent residents and call this place home, uh, I don't think any of us actually currently working here right now were born here. We're all transplants. Producing artistic director Lisa Bryant says the Playhouse is still growing. It's offering even more family programming. You, you consider we started in 1937 and all of the history that has taken place between now and then, um, it, it's really, it's exceptional and it, I mean it's kind of a miracle. It's a great blessing to be able to live in a, a normal small town, not having to live in the big city, and really get to do what you love to do, but also get to know these patrons who come every single show and really want to be a part of making it survive and flourish. Celebrating a major milestone for this community's rock. Mike McCormick, WIFF News 4, Flat Rock.